Today, we're doing something special. In this video from earlier this week, I asked you to leave a comment with a random deck suggestion. And today, I am picking that random comment. If I press this button, one out of the 870 comments that were on the video will get picked with a random deck for me to play. Start raffle and pick the winner. Here we go, Chad, here we go. Boom. I'd love for you to play this curious shellfolk deck. Vrail Night Viper, I got you. Okay, so I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna be completely honest here. I've never played this. I know this is a thing. I know this is a thing that exists, but I have never tried it. I, I do feel like I'm gonna have to overrule uh, the group shot and put in the backpack because th this deck has been updated. So there is one small change to the deck, but I think it's the right thing to do. Vrail Night Viper, this one's for you. Happy high rolling. Okay, so this should be this should be a fantastic matchup, yeah? Alright, alright. We're still learning. We're still learning. I I'm still just clueless. Alright. Please play dragons and deep deck. That that is that is D, &D actually. That is that is the DD deck. Dragons and deep. So I'll just keep predicting for the spell predicts, right? So anyway, I miss your content so much, just got out of the hospital after a week's day yesterday and your stuff was my first watch. But DC, I hope you're okay, man. I hope everything's uh, everything's all right. Oh, thank you for the kind words. Double Valley, I'm down. Any thoughts on Trinomir and how to fix him? Uh, I think Trinomir should still level when he dies, but they should remove the revive thing on his level up. So he levels when he dies, but he also just dies. So, essentially, nothing happens. Alright, well, we have the combo, so we just need to get to turn 6 with the double valley we have a predict. Let's see. Oh my god. Um, I mean, passing here is like not that bad, right? If we pass, we get to play this as like backup next turn. I think I'm passing for now. Let's see what they do first. Again, I'll see what they do. If they decide to like pull the trigger. Watchful. I'm still not really afraid of this. I'm, I'm down. I'm down. We're passing. We're passing. We have triple shell folk next turn. So just getting this one extra ancient prep is going to be so big. All right, what are they going to do? Rally? Endless cold. Endless okay, here we go. Why do they always laugh? What, what, what's funny? What is funny? Oh, God. Okay, so now I am just going to play the backpacks. I kind of want to keep mana for the condensed too. Okay, here we go, here we go. But wait, there's more. We actually have uh, the right to just win anyway. Yeah, I could just ride actually. Yeah, what are they at? 40. <laughs> 84. Yeah, so that's a miss. I'll just skip because uh, this is all the man I'm using anyway. Okay. So do you say that he hates combo decks? I still do, I still do. But this was a, a random comment from YouTube, so you know, sometimes you're forced into it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's a very good draw. Okay, okay. All right. Again! Here we go. <laughs> and this time, there's four of them. <laughs> I 
<laughs> nah, that's vile, man. That's disgusting. It's not okay. Alright, I mean, opponent's like, screw it, uh, I'ma just do my own thing. Dude. I can, I can only recreate, my hand is full. How much is that? Plus 28, alright. 172. More predicts, alright. Nah, dude. Nah, this is this is this is ridiculous. What is this? What, what, <laughs> what is this? Oh, more predicts. All right. Yeah, I think we're this is pretty close to infinite, huh? Two hundred fifty six. All right. Well, uh, grab a drink. We'll be here for a second. Five hundred thirty six. But wait, there's more. All right. Who else is excited for the uh, for the eternal season? Because I'm not. I'm not excited. Oh, 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 there was like an overlap on that. I, I thought that was a, uh, <laughs> I thought that was a backpack. Uh, 832. <laughs> Dude, that's so dumb. What? I think I probably should just turn on auto pass. Uh, or they might have left already, honestly. I think they left. All right. I'm going to play these two and, and then we're going to say go, all right? We'll see what happens. Pokey stick to Sentry? Actually, you're right. That, that, that should be the play right now. No, you're right, you're right. <laughs> when I went to take a shower? I mean, they, they, oh, there we go. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Oh. I can't play them anymore? I can't play anymore. All right, here we go. How many? Oh my god! <laughs> I think Riot locked the account halfway through there. <laughs> hmm. Rise, huh? Rise. Would you replace Fizz with for a more free-to-play version? Okay, I, I mean, this is an epic, so I want to first of all say be very careful because there, there's no guarantee that this will actually be a good deck when Eternal Season comes around. Um, when we look ahead, we know but if I were to prepare. replace Fizz, I'd probably like put a put in a maybe a Teemo if you have it. If not, more predicts or a stun or something along See those lines. The one to the cap, yeah, skip, skip could be a thing. Is, is skip an epic? You lack subtlety. I try. Well, Sonny, thank you so much for the lovely chat this morning. It really made my day while I was stuck at work. Hey, it was fun talking to you, man. Uh, very kind comment too. Thank you. Uh, I have to skip here. I will shoot your nexus. Is Let me at him. What do you mean when the eternal season comes around? Is Shelfog ro Shelfog is already rotated. Shelfog is a rotated card. Okay, we need to we need to landmark here. What right do I have to use a world rune? I coming in. Yeah, this is eternal. Yes. 
Why won't you listen? I don't think he blocked his if you rise. I'm, I'm, I'm bluffing there, by the way. Like, I would prefer them not to block because I don't want to use a spell to give the kids illusion. Okay, Condense is like something to help with the shelf folk. Rotate shelf folk from eternal to delete a card. Yeah, I can't disagree with that. This is in his deck for his ability to stop spells with a spell. I don't think that's true. Oh, they hit the condensed. That's unfortunate. Oh, I gotta try that one. The spirit gives to those who listen. Most of the stuff they're doing doesn't really matter that much. If you had to pick a favorite deck of this entire expansion post changes, what would it be today? Oh, probably the uh, the dragon deck so far. Oh no, it, I mean, it doesn't count. But the Twisted Fate Gangplank deck we played yesterday was so much fun. I actually just completely lost track of time when we played that. Just just like printing Twisted Fate, that was fun. Bobus, they were the tier on sub. Ik vind hem mij. They were the prime sub as well. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Freedom, but found only the void. I have four cards and I have five. This, this game, this game, it was gonna take a little while. Cause we, th th this prank on the condense is very annoying. Three oh fuck! Already. Twenty? Tw uh, Twenty? Thank you for three months. Appreciate it, thank you. Thank god Rise isn't a good deck like game. I mean, they're, they're pretty slow right now. I've definitely lost games against Rise on like turn seven or eight. Your final lesson that I alone must bear this burden. Bye, Fizz. <laughs> Fuenny is in number one. Yeah, I had a feeling that's what it was. <laughs> Are you playing the Luigi one? I mean, if I had to pick favorite decks in the expansion rather than the patch update, I would say it's um, it's Telsey Volibear. That was a banger deck. Stand by in the face of apocalypse. Fist can't stop rise to landmark damage. Yeah, it, Fist can because it's not targeted. I think it's time to start printing, Mr. Dreamer. It is time to start printing next turn, yes. Oh, all right, here we go. Just don't low roll. That's uh, that, that's all there is to it. Do not low roll. Whatever it takes, do not low roll. Telsey Volibear with uh, Anakan and Anaka. That was, that was the most fun deck to me. Here we go. Why does one have Prismatic? Uh, one was created by Shelful, because I chose it in a prediction. Uh, that's the non-Prismatic one, because my Shelful isn't Prismatic. I mean, you know, we missed a few, but it doesn't really matter. We still have fuel. Why is that one not your favorite anymore? It, I mean, it still is. I just haven't played in a while. What's the max amount of cards you can play in a turn? You can play 15 of one card. You upload a video on it? Yes, I did. Let's see if I can link it in a second. <laughs> We're rising to rise, player. 
I'm surprised they're still here, actually. Okay, we reached the max, we reached the max, we passed. So that's uh, 480. 480 puff caps. All right, good luck. I'm sure you'll be okay, Rice player. There we go. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, okay, GG. <laughs> uh, yeah, because the thing is, they draw a card, which could already kill them, and then when they have to play another two runes to actually win, that's a draw two at the very least, because of the uh, the red rune. Uh, it, it'll be 10 points to Gryffindor. Zeg needs some Mr. Thrift. It's too slow. Doesn't work. I, it, yeah, okay. Cool. There's Shape Stone. There's Condense. Uh, but the landmark is eight. And you want to get it to zero on turn six, exactly. Well, let's try again. Right negation, there you go. Yeah, no, you, you can shoot your own unit with this. That is true, that's true, that's true. Yeah, I'll take another rally. Why not? Let me guide you. This a question, isn't Teemo good in this deck? Um, I don't really think so, because again, you're popping off on turn six, you're just shuffling a million shrooms, and then you're gonna say go. It's not like you're shuffling shrooms before that. You don't really have to double the shrooms. Be at peace. I mean, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's like when you're popping off on turn six, I don't think you really get to attack with Teemo. I think. Fizz better than Teemo? I mean, Fizz is a 2 1. Your star and it's an brilliant. elusive blocker that holds up a little better. I I don't know. I didn't build this deck. It's from the YouTube comments. I, I think the, the, the list itself makes sense, though. It does. What is the goal of this deck? Okay, I think this game you're about to find out, okay? This time, they're not hitting the uh, the Freljord Jax curve, so we might actually be able Looks to show up. what it's about. Boy, that's a lot of damage. Hope crystallizes. Unyielding. Oh my God. Live with purpose. All right, let's see. Here we go. It is time. Any backpackers? Backpack. There you go. Yeah, so that's the point of the deck. <laughs> this is the point. Uh, 112 right now. Should I, I think I'm going to take one more Shelful for next turn. All right. I'm gonna say go, and the next turn we're gonna play another Curious Shellfolk. We'll have four, and then we also have the Forsaken Bakai plus the Scrying Sands. And you know, if I'm gonna be honest, that is probably going to be enough to kill them. They are at 220. <laughs> you only played 10? Yeah, but it's fine, because next turn we can do more. They don't have the attack token. We could just, uh, we, we, we could just optimize it. We can just completely just go through the ceiling, you know? I'm glad this deck is not good. Hey, me too, me too.
this deck cannot be allowed to be good. It's it's really nice that Valley of Imitation got nerfed, huh? God, they they they, uh, they were right on time with that one. Would it matter if Valley was three? I mean, it's like because it's three mana, it's like much harder for this deck to defend itself. I think that's essentially what it comes down to. Oh, <laughs> minus 11, huh? Whew, that's rough, buddy. That sucks. No, that does suck. All right. More. Oh, it's their turn. Never mind. So, uh, we'll do that, and yeah, you know, it's a good amount. It is. Boom, 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 boom. What do you guys think? Dead? It might be dead. Don't think so. <laughs> All right, a couple more, a couple more. Dude, it's so filthy, man. No, I'm, I'm glad to say maybe maybe it's because I suck, but I have been playing Rutera for three years. And if I'm struggling with a deck, usually that means, you know, it's, it's probably not the easiest deck. So if this deck is not good and it's hard to play, I think we're I think we're OK. All right. I think, I think that'll be fine. A thousand ninety three. It's just stupid, man. You've watched all the One Piece? Uh, well, actually, let me let me uh, let me show what's on the back here to answer that question. Like that? Uh, the answer is no. No, I didn't. I'm on episode twenty. Oh, okay, we're stuck. All right, we're stuck. Twelve eighty nine. All right, all right. <laughs> No, I, I started watching One Piece last week, so I'm on episode 20 or something. I, I I think it's pretty good. Like, I generally don't really like watching old animes, but so far, so good, man. So far, it's pretty good. Shell Folk is pretty degenerate, too. I don't, know, I don't even think it's as bad as what Blade Dance has done to the game. Yeah, like, you have to realize, sure, if this pops off, yes, it's pretty degenerate. But the, the sheer amount of damage that Blade Dance has done to the game when it came out doesn't even come close to this, like, bad combo deck that sometimes makes you miserable. So I tried your deck builder on bursting backpack station archivist evil friction and sunken temple. I must say it's genius. I had a you had a hundred. Listen, man, that that makes you better than I was because I could not achieve that. Well done. Deep down, I love this Ureli, but only when I played it. Yeah. No. Um. So the thing with Blade Dance is I I played it when it came out, right? When that expansion came out, I already had like my YouTube channel running, going strong, getting like 1k views a video, being happy, you know, while I was still going to school. And I was like, oh, sweet new expansion. Let me try this new Azir Aurelia Blade Dance deck. And I won like almost every game with it. And I was like, haha, funny combo. Haha, my opponent can't do anything. And then, you know, not much later, it turned out to just be tier zero. And then I was like, hmm. Playing against this is even more miserable than the actual joy I felt when I played it. Okay, I'm looking for cheap spell predicts. Why bird is shining? Because a bird can now block elusives. There we go. I really have played a bit more controllers with the one for is actually fun. Skylar. Skylar, we shook hands in real life. You've been on this channel for so long. What do you mean? Explain yourself. What do you mean? We shared a meal together. And this, you're, th this is we really are? You come to my house. You eat my food. Get out of here. <laughs> Wow, that, that, man. Secret Keeper been working. Oh, this is active every turn, huh? Mangle them. Dante the Dreamer, take me to Prime Sub. 
So I was, uh, I played some League of Legends yesterday. I played some Jax jungle. I gotta say, that champion feels smooth as butter, actually. My god, I had no idea. That rework made him feel so freaking smooth. How much do you fish? I got like three gold in the game where I figured out that it's something I could do. <laughs> this stood in the river with my rod. Yeah, Jax, J Jax, Jax, not Jax. Share the bounty of our success. There we go. In and out. For our city. City. Yeah, I popped up every single game. I mean, you know, I've been playing jungle for like a pretty long time. Uh, at a well. Somewhat high level for most of it. But, uh. Yeah, man, he just feels smooth. Just, I pop that every game. He just feels smooth as butter. That's all I can say. And again, Fiddle Sticks to Master on YouTube tomorrow. Dark Lord Beyonce! Thank you for the three months. Uh, so I'm, I'm not using this, by the way, because I was scared of like a. Uh, I don't know, like a Desert Duel or Grappling Hook or something. And since we hit the Condense, I could just do this. Shelfhook used to be 6 health. Yeah, it used to be a 4-6. Correct. Did you continue Fiddlestone Master or did you only do one stream of that? Uh, I only did one stream so far. But now that it's going to be on YouTube, uh, it will be continued. Wait, this is the valley, right? Condense. Valley, valley. Oh, this is the regular one. Okay. These sort of valley. Yes, and hmm. we're doing a bit of missing. No, you're you're good, dude. You're good. I'm uh, I'm not hitting. There we go. Three more chances to hit. I mean, I might as well take this now. This is like gambling, yeah, but you get so many chances to do it. Happy to be here. Looking forward to many more streams to come. Have a grand. I think for the 11 months. Appreciate the support. There we go. We found it. There's only one though. Oh, never mind. It's, it's, I thought I had more than one. Never mind. Never mind. Alright, come on, man. Come on. Bro, where are they? Huh? Am I, am I doing something wrong? Riot? Riot? Hello? Bro! I'm hostaging my opponent at this point! What? Where? Where is she? Okay, you know, that creates three extra copies in the deck. We should actually be there now. There we go. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> all right. Woo, calm down. We're here. We're here now, chat. We're good. We're good. Ah. Took a while. And then I didn't find any predicts. 
you know what? Whatever. I think we're we're almost reaching a cap anyway. Wait, this would actually be kind of hilarious with Kahiri, right? Instead, wait, that's so funny actually. Doing this with Kahiri instead of backpack. That's so funny. But because all you're doing is just predicting a million times to hit the Kahiri. Your Kahiri would actually just be like a 40-40. Alright, your turn. You out of predicts now? I mean, they don't get removed from the deck. But yes, we are out of predicts, technically. But, you know, they, there's a good chance they're just dead. Run from oh yeah, we can condense another predict, yeah. Blessings of abundance! One chime? Oh, this one must have been freshly shuffled, man. How is that one chime? <laughs> Yeah, I think this must have been like a freshly shuffled Righteous one. This is justice. Watch some like Absolver for the win or something. I wonder if we're dead here. We could actually just if they have Absolver, maybe. Is it created? It doesn't say it's created. Is it does that is it not created? Don't touch it. It's not safe. This not being created sounds very unlikely. How is it doesn't say it's created. How is that possible? <sighs> That's really weird. Oh, they're Giga Chats. What are we doing to this poor man? Huh. I don't feel bad anymore. We missed again. Oh, oh my god! This oh round seven by the way. Here we go. Round seven. Yeah. No, that seems that seems about right. <laughs> this doesn't even include all the skips we did. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, GG. Alright, to redeem ourselves because we kind of made the life of an ARAM player miserable, we're gonna do this again and we're gonna remove the backpacks with Kahiri. Okay. <laughs> Luxy mode. Oh no. The toxicity. Alright, how many? An era of prosperity. Two chimes? How? Okay, well, I mean, they're dead, but how did I hit like three chimes when I had 600 in my deck? Okay, 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 Kiri time, Kiri time. Zillion rotated? Zillion is rotated, yeah. We also don't want Zillion in his deck because he creates time bombs. And yeah, as weird as it sounds, you don't want to like dilute your deck to make the stuff you actually want to hit less likely. Oh, we have the combo. And I know from experience that this deck plays a little bit slower. The goal is to not let them steal our Kahiri. That's uh, that, that's the goal. When we look ahead, we know how to prepare. Suns beneath me and winds behind me. And winds behind me. I go, I go. They should make Kahiri Don't cost for. I agree. Make Kahiri really like a four mana tutu or something. Actually, he, he he might be broken if they do that. For four mana? I don't know. That's like, that's in the questionable territory. I don't know. Sunny, today is spooky day. Any spooky deck in mind? We did that yesterday. We played spooky gangplank and twisted fate. Give him a better keyword. Like what? 
I'm actually pretty curious. What would be a better keyword for uh, for Kahiri? He, he was he was five. No, he was six mana. Four four, I think. Over yeah, I mean, see, that's what I mean. If you give him overall spell shoot, it's like, oh, now it's broken. Did they just burn? <laughs> they just burned their rock bear, man. Sir. Come on now. That's that's kind of sad. <laughs> okay, so I mean <laughs> Are we dead if they play I think we're dead if they play Viego, so I have to do this. What a shame for you! I think I have to. I would I would love to wait another turn, but not if they could potentially play Viego this turn. Fearsome and Brash. I mean I don't I doubt they would play put Brash in Sharima. The thing is, if 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 Kahiri has Overwhelm, it'd be like much better. Obviously, I don't know if it would be broken. Like it's so specific, maybe it wouldn't even be broken. But then you also lose like the the build around, right? But then again, if they can give Swain Overwhelm, surely they can give Kahiri Overwhelm. You know, you know what I mean? That should make our next turn pretty good, at least. Yeah, I think Quick Attack would probably probably be worse. Good morning. Okay, I'm at four HP. However, <laughs> I got three chip statues. I probably need to keep mana open for one condense. Yeah, I think I need to do the pop off next turn. Am I alive though? I, I can't just play this. Till again. Yo, we hit. Alright. With the power of time, and the chain is the broken. Are endless. Make Kahiri fade it. Yeah, and make a proc fade it every time you predict it. Chip Valley had a synergy with Kahiri. Wow. <laughs> Alright, we go again. At 4 HP. Impact per predict. That's interesting. Yeah, that would be a real game finisher. But then it's like, why are you working for the stats at all, you know? That's fine. When we look ahead, we know Where are you at, Kiri? My journey won't end oh. until I'm oh. it. Hold on, they just randomly rolled over on for the Talia. That's that's potentially very bad. You know, second place is fine. That is potentially no just game. Place, no one. In this timeline, we're sure right, to come on, Where you at, Kiri? There he is. I'm, I'm gonna have to take one of them. I probably need to play this so we can have like an actual big blocker. Granted that we hit Kiri's. Ahead, we know how to prepare. Oh man, I don't feel so good. Wait, first, yeah, I think I should play it. I'm back. It's so good to see you again, my dear friend. You weren't gone long, but I worried every second. I'm uh, I'm out of like next door. We can't do the uh, the shell folks anymore, is a problem. So if we don't hit here, we're just dead, and we didn't hit. Like so. Alright, back a plan. <laughs> I will run we either kill them here Excuse me. or things will look bad. We probably can't kill the Talia. 
It's just that we're, we're, we're out of shelf walks now. Because they killed the other one and I didn't condense. Do they know? Alright, so we found another way to win. I guess. <laughs> Wait, what is this deck, man? Help. <laughs> No, no, no. Don't get me wrong. There was absolutely no question about it. This was going to be a lot worse than the backpack. I just uh, I just wanted to see, you know, how how much worse. Thinking outside the box, Zillion Victor, Time Bomb Printer, One, Two, Meta Shifter, Not a Quitter, Fighting for a